Rush, and he has no escape mechanisms left. Might be trying to use the ulti to escape. Does do so for now. Walking away with the stone plate, but White Lotus unstoppable with the damage. Edward now going to be stunned up even through the Alistair ultimate. Well, He's diving. still going to drop. In comes Seiya. The dunk into the ground. The double kill for White Lotus. The taunt comes through on Takira. The triple for White Lotus. Looking to make it even more. He's got the quadra. Oh, they're they're going to give it over. The pentakill for White Lotus. Big pentakill in the hole game goes towards Lion. They're going to be able to kill the Nexus as they'd like right now. Big performance from the eight. <sighs> oh, Man, it's all been... Oh. What, bitch? Alright, not bad. I'll take that. Not the cleanest, dude, but good enough. Could have been to still be able to get that headbutt in the right position and get Jensen out of the way, but that's why it looked a little bit strange. It was like he was holding onto the pulverize forever, but gets the stun uh, previously gained anyway. So, uh, uh, but he was uh, very uh, Okay. We can definitely win this game. Yeah, we can. Yeah, yeah. Definitely win this one. Holy shit. Where are you at? <clears throat> so, can you drop a word? I need word. Or... Thanks. I just need to wait for the ash now to overextend just a tiny bit. I do repeat, I am coming in hot! Oh! Later, the movement speed. Oh, I like this remark. 
already going aggressive in comparison to what we saw from Brewster as well. Well, he does have the Elise on this side too, who's level three. Gonna get in there on Jensen. Yeah, Rappel is going to come down as the rev up is slowing Jensen. The flash goes there, forward. Goon. Goon. Max range with the cleanse comes in. Ball and in trouble. Sub 100 health and that's first blood for Jensen. Contract's in trouble, Mark. He wants it. Oh! No! No, he doesn't. And Cloud9, 2-0 to start things off. By the skin of his teeth. Contrax gets away, Jensen gets the kill with the axe. Still gonna take quite a lot of damage. He puts Chippy where he is right now. A little bit under half HP. For continuing to trade with him. There you go. The grand challenge has been issued. Very nice repose stun. Oh, he's got it hurt with the outplay, however. Chippy's had his splash available, but he's not gonna be able to do it. One turret shot is all it takes to outplay your opponent here for MVP turret is Shurnfire. Shurnfire potentially getting caught out as the enemy invades his jungle. And honestly, Vert with the brand. There's the return of that skin. <laughs> Missed out on yesterday. Edward throwing the snowball out on some Mystic. A lot of slow effect on this one. That one. Oh, the, oh, the exhaust. They're going all the way in on this one. Mystic, they want to pop some kind of a summoner on him. They at least get his heal. Exhaust for heal on these guys. Oh, no Don't chill at all. Oh, this oh, guy. Guy. Back in the flash away from Mystic. They're probably going to go after him. It's the first blood for the dog ball. Mystic, I mean, I guess they wanted a ward in the bush, but it's not going to be the kind of ward that keeps him alive. <laughs> Mystic's just going to get blasted and die to the dog. This game is great. Here comes Condi at 957. You don't get a free red buff. All right, WE flexing those muscles, trying to steal this one away, but it's Diamond Prox who gets it now. 957 on the run, but Kira's made the rotation as well, and it's a 2-0 game for Gambit Esports. I mean, it's just unlucky, you know? These things happen. Uh, yeah. <laughs> sometimes you just you lose really early on in League of Legends. Set up a bit of a trap here. Him and Zero waiting. Oh, this is Blast Cone. The longest the long con. Blasting, wandering back down as he sees them go over the wall. Oh, he has another one. He's locked into it anyway. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> he was like, he can't be shopping. What was he doing? <laughs> I'm not quite sure, Rusty. <laughs> he was. Domínio mais uma vez, completo foi como eu falei no início da partida. A gente olhava a grande composição da equipe da Dario Wolves, as eliminações acumulando e você poderia se enganar. Nossa, estão muito à frente, esse jogo já era, mas o tempo inteiro. A Cloud9 esteve bem ciente do que eles deviam fazer, o momento que eles deveriam entrar, como eles deveriam cuidar daquele mapa e avançar. Too, bro. Oh, too clean five you, bro. That's what I'm talking about. Huh? You know, screw this mumbo jumbo. Let's just jump right into the video, man. Let's let's get into it. All right, here's a little sneak peek. <laughs> 